Good morning, guys. It is Wednesday already. We're headed to the bar because somebody's got a lesson and it's not me. It's one something. Yeah, it is 10 after 1. I can't read it backwards. I, I don't even know if I have all my stuff. As long as I got my phone and my camera and my water, I'm good, right? And my license, because I'm driving. Anyway, Sophie's got a lesson. I don't know if I told you guys that Sophie and I switched lessons times because she wanted to and I was like, yeah, let's do it. Right? <laughs> oh my Anything for my babies. Anyway, we're headed to the barn. It's scorching. It is going to be 26 degrees today. First time of the season. What? Something weird happens with our car. Gabby's door doesn't unlock. No matter what door she tries to get in, it won't unlock. It's so weird. Anyway, we are headed to the barn. Don't know how to dress for the barn, you guys. You gotta Look fill me in. Look clean. at Gabby's boots. Aren't they gorgeous? How they're come they're kind of clean? How come they're so gorgeous? I polished them last night. Yeah, we brought the everything home. Stuff, not the wax. Yeah. And not... look at before it used to be a bit brown here. Help! I cannot find my my keys and we're dying of the heat. Oh. Not air conditioning, it takes too long. Windows. Windows, air conditioning takes too long. Sophie's here too in the back, right Sophie, you're here? Yeah. Anyway, so okay, so I'm dressed for the day. I have on a t-shirt and a skirt. This is what I wear in the summer. So a t-shirt and a skirt, what you have to wear for shoes is flip-flops or sandals. That's all that gets along with it. And when even when you wear shorts, flip-flops and sandals. There are no running shoes made on earth that go with flip-flops and sandals unless they're really tiny, like have no back and have just like a toe, like fancy kind of pretty running shoes, if that makes sense. So what the heck do I wear? So now I'm wearing a shirt, a t-shirt and a, and a skirt and disgusting running shoes. Disgusting running shoes. So then let's talk about the running shoes. Okay, so these used to be my expensive running shoes. They were $210 and now they're barn shoes and I can't wear them anywhere else because they're disgusting. So I gotta wear these at the barn. Then I have these white ones that I save over here in case we go someplace after the barn so I can switch into them. Like it's just a mess. I don't know how to, I don't know how to coordinate guys. I do not know how to coordinate real life to barn life. So I got to wear like, yeah, barn explain, life every day. explain it to me, explain it to me. Cause I'm falling behind here. But anyway, let's go, let's go to the barn. We're going to shoot a couple of videos there and a vlog. And yeah, and I got videos I'm editing for Gabby's channel. It's been a whirlwind this week so far, but it's been exciting oh, and guys. fun. I made a video last night. Yeah, and I haven't seen it yet. It's on this camera right now. Got Sophie, when I was editing last night, Sophie made a video, and what's it about? Um, what your questions do when they get bored. Yeah, and I think when she has a video. Home. Yeah, I think she has that video already made on her channel, but well, we'll see. We'll see if that video she made last night, if we can make another video with it. Also on the agenda is the grass at our house is so long, I just cut it on Thursday. So now I have to cut that again today. But enough complaining, let's go. Everybody, can you feel the groove? Grab somebody. We are here at the barn and it's a gorgeous summer day. Wait, Even though it's not summer yet, it's so nice outside. Hope it stays. Anyway, yeah. um, Sophie got out of the car and you know that new thing that I got for, for Mother's Day, that the seat organizer thing? It was full of food. She stuffed so much food in there. It was Pop-Tarts and Butter Tarts. Pop-Tarts and Butter Tarts, who wastes Butter Tarts? Like, I, yeah, no. No more wasting food, Missy. <laughs> Look at all the changes, guys. They're fencing in this area out here behind this barn. Have They're this? fencing in an area up there outside the arena. And, and, donkey and they're fencing in this area up here too. Why? They're getting sheep. 
if you guys can hear the donkey, he's Bill. That's he's Bill. He's, he's old. Yeah, and so they're building a pen for him so he can go outside up here. And they're building a pen for sheep, which will be super cool. That looks like a jungle forest. Yeah, I love those fern plants. Do you guys see them? It's like a big jungle of ferns. I like it, I like it too. Wow, is that Tex? Yeah. Wow, Tex, they all have the same blanket. Oh, because they went to a big sale. I think Tex has a zebra blanket. No. Oh, no, he has no blanket on. Wait, isn't that Tex? That's blue. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All Fiona's have the same fly sheet on. <laughs> Somebody made a sound. And then they all freaked out. <laughs> You're all, you're all okay. It's always a false alarm. You're all okay. So, I can't tell horses apart. Like, there's no, like, when they all have the exact same blanket on. Yeah, hey, and Mom, a fly mask. What was that? That's Ben, I can tell Ben. Yeah. and what was, what was it? Ozzy. Yeah. I can tell Ben and Ozzy. Okay, look how pretty, you guys. Okay, Mom, guess which one is Just say, don't hold my arm. Look how pretty. Like, come on, isn't that so pretty? You're pretty too. Yes, you are. He's like, okay, if you got apples, I'll come with you. He's kind of small. What? He's a small horse. He's 52. He's as tall as Blue. He used to be one inch taller than Blue. Does he have shoes on? He's getting shoes on. I didn't tell you guys that. Storm's getting shoes on next week. You're getting your shoes back, my love. We definitely think he goes better in shoes. Something. She's gonna poo. Right. Okay, guys. Um. So my mom was gonna give Storm a mint. <sighs> yes, I'm. And he was about like, him. No. And he was like, oh, an apple. He dived in for her hand, and then he, as soon as he touched the mint, he was like, no. Ew. He hates it. Uh, this is another thing I don't understand. How am I supposed to clean up this with my runners on? And these are why my runners are now barn runners. Disgusting. I'm putting the more coconut. All right, so a poor Sabrina has suffered a massacre due to a beginner pulling on her mane. Sophia pulls so <laughs> hard. That's terrible. I'm so, I used to do it to Jasmine. You used to do it to Jasmine? I'm so sorry. Okay, you guys know how I have been freaking myself out about the shows. Okay, maybe you guys don't know, but I've been freaking myself out about the shows. Like, it just seems really hard, and everything has to be perfect and clean and beautiful, and that's just not me. I'm like a mess waiting to happen. Like, I usually even have dirt on my clothes all the time, like, because I spill all the time. Like, I am the exact, exact, opposite of perfect so shows scare me and one of the things that scares me is the whole mane and the pulling of the mane and the braiding of the mane and I know Sabrina needs her mane pulled because she's got a lot of hair so I don't even know what you would do with this what a mess but we are not experienced enough for that Right? Anyway, so it all starts with that, but then you get to the part where you have to do the braiding of the mane. The braiding of the mane. And it has got me so freaked out. So, something else about me that you might not know is I'm always gonna find the easy way. Right, Sophia? We're gonna always find the easy way. And we may have found an easy way for braiding. We have quick knot. So we got these, they're called Quick Knot, and they come in different colors, different sizes, and we got the black ones, and they're small for Storm, and we got these big honking ones for Sabrina. 
Big honky won't die, baby. Right? We can say big honking to our horse and she doesn't care. Anyway, so we're gonna show you right now what we do with these to make braids, right? Yeah, we're supposed to make them super easy, so we're gonna try it. We have our trusted elastics that a subscriber sent to us a long time ago, this like maybe in February. Doesn't purple look amazing? On yeah, purple looks amazing on her. All right, so let's get started. All right, so I started my braids by separating the hair. And I watched a video and it said to separate the hair, you can do it all at the beginning so that it's equal, so that they're all equal. I made sure to wash the mane first. And she's looking at me like, what are you doing? You have not touched my mane for 10 months. And now all of a sudden you're braiding my hair? No, I've done it to her. I yeah. brushed her hair. Okay, this looks beautiful, you guys. I just love it. It might look messy to you, but I love a free, beautiful horse. Isn't it so pretty? You got me feeling. You got me feeling all right. Whenever I'm around you, baby, you make me feel. Spa day at the barnstorm. Spa day. So what I've been doing with Storm um, I have been putting coconut oil um, on his mane and tail to help it grow better and be stronger. Um, so yeah, that I just put some on right now. Um, and go to Costco, guys, because I found this huge thing of coconut oil. Like... Look at how big it is compared to my hand. Well, my hand's pretty big. But yeah, it's huge. Go to Costco and see if they have it, because it's only 20 bucks. 20 bucks for this huge thing. <clears throat> and at a different store, I saw a little, not even a quarter of this um, full jar. It's 10 bucks, but 20 bucks for that buy that uh, but yeah and it's actually been improving like the thickness of his mane which i love i love um so i just put it on and that's why it looks a bit wet but yeah so today i'm going to be cutting his whiskers and look at how t long this tail is when he rests one foot it touches the ground so i want to cut it up to his hocks Bring it up to here. But first, I'm, I have permission from my mom. But first, I'm cutting his long whiskers. Ooh, okay, so, dun da da da! I know you're meant to count the braids to make sure that they're all equal, and you're meant to um, pull her mane, but she's going home, and I'm not pulling anything. I saw Jessie pull her horse's mane, yeah, and it hurts. The whole time I was braiding her hair, she was like, get off of me! And she was just exactly like my kids when I'm pulling on their hair. She, so it doesn't feel good. People said it doesn't hurt them. It does hurt them. She's like, I'm not your friend anymore. <laughs> Sabrina, no. Oh dear. People are gonna be mad at you. I know, but I'm just cutting them a bit. She's just trimming them, guys. Just <laughs> trimming them, I'm not shaving them because I have scissors. But... Yeah, they're really long. I watched videos on how to put these on. These quick knots are supposed to be so quick and so easy that a kid can do them. So, Gabby's like, let me do it first. Okay, so, here we go. So after I'm gonna be really slow at this. Yeah, Gabby's really slow. Um, so, after it's braided, you just roll it under. You take the quick knot, poke it through, don't poke her because I'm standing underneath her feet. I know. Poke it right through the end, and then bend it under. It's a no. bit hard to bend. For You're me. bending under, not up. Oh. Don't poke her. My first time is bad, but... Let me see. You can actually see it. Okay, let's see. Because I did it wrong, but... <gasps> so good. I did it wrong. This is my okay. first time let me ever try. doing Let me try, let me try, let me try, let me try. Okay, try. wait, wait, let me try. No, no, These no, are no, my first try. time ever doing these kinds okay, of things. Okay, but was it quick? Yes. Was it easy? Yes. This is what it looks like. Isn't that cool? And the cool thing is they're reusable. So when you're like, done... You can't see it. When you're done, you, it, can, yeah. you can take it out and use it again. Yeah, if you're careful. Okay. Right 
Woo. Flies. No, Sabrina, don't push me off the stool. Stop Sabrina. it. Sabrina, hey. Oh. Easy. There. Is that, that what it's supposed to look like? Okay, our braids kind of stuck. Mine looks a little bit better. Yeah, okay. But so easy. I think I did my braids too loose. We try this one. That one looks good. No, Mom, I need to try. Okay, right. Let's see Sophie do it. <laughs> Sabrina, Sabrina does not want us doing it. She tried to push me off the stool. Did you guys see that? <laughs> She's scratching. Yeah, she pushes me off the stool. Okay, push it. Do it. Mm-hmm. So you gotta make your knot nice and tight. Yeah, this. Okay, wait, 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 you better not. Here, let me do it. Oh, I definitely need to roll it tighter. Sabrina. Hey. I wonder if she can smell food in my purse. She probably does. Just let. There, I love it. That's better. So now look, I can take this one out. So I can take this one out. And start again. Ooh. Reusable so you don't have to buy them every single time. Yeah, reusable. Okay, that's not as cute. If I was a better, better braider though, so cool. I love it. Do you love it, Sabrina? Did you see that? She shook her head yes. Say yes, 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 yes. See, she loves she it too. Know. Can I cut it to here? Yep. Cry, people. Cry with me. Just cry. He hardly has any hair, and the hair that she's cut, he does have. She's cutting. There we go. See, it looks a lot much neater than like broken ends sticking. Good on the job, here. sister. Good job. So that's what happens when you have your own horse. You have to like do that kind of stuff. Yeah, I like it though. Wait. I like it too. Dun dun da da. Kind of messy. The braids themselves are messy, but the quick knots are awesome. Uh huh. Cause it's our first time ever doing. Yeah. That. But I love it. Yeah, I didn't do this one. I obviously I'm meant to be afraid of the whole show thing and the braiding thing. Cause like I said, I'm not that good at it. But I am definitely in love with quick knots. These almost make changing from hunters to jumpers worth it because these jumper braids would be so much easier than the hunter ones that we have to sew. Horses know. Like I've never seen her stand so still. So all she's doing is trimming her whiskers. Yeah, like I did before. Just trimming the whiskers. Second time ever, I didn't really do a proper one the first time. And so Gabby did it on Storm. You can't really he see. He's really thin Because hair. he's black and the little click Quick knot, quick knot is black too. We got black ones and for him. It actually doesn't show the quick knot. Yeah, I know. It's super cool.
That's go around the center jump. That's close, close to the big box. That strap really helps there her. Go. Kiss. Yes. Ready, and you know what we changed the motion to the barn go a little more to the building. Let's get this strap. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Okay. Nope, we can go straight. And rising cross. So trot on. Wow, that's a big blue jump. Big trot. Turn in. And grab that strap. Good girl. Do it again. He's probably afraid it was that oxer again. The first time he did it, he was like, whoa, what is that? It was an and, extra pole. and then the second time he like click 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 jumped it. Lauren. Grab that strap. Kick, kick, kick. Good girl. So see how she's starting to stop on the other side of the jump? We gotta make her go as soon as she lands. Push her on. No stopping on the other side of the fences. So you're gonna jump and imagine you're gonna gallop away. Click, click, click. Grab that strap and gallop away. Good job. And gallop away. Good job. That was just slow motion. You okay? Oh, Good job, kiddo. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Did you get hurt or you just feel scared? I'm so scared. Okay, well, let's look at it. Okay, let go of her. You hit the jump with your knees. Take a big breath. Can you wiggle it? Yeah? Can you bend it? Good. We bumped it. It was probably scary mostly. Mm -hmm. oh, I feel like crying. When you cry, it makes me cry. Okay, let's get you back up on your pony. It's okay. You got this, kiddo. It's okay. How bad does it hurt? Oh. It's not broken. <laughs> Just kidding. What's the rule? Hospital? Or, or back, back on. on? That's a good time. <laughs> Yeah, hospitals don't let you use your phone. It'd be boring. <laughs> Can you put it in there, kiddo? Ready? You know who's gonna be really sad he missed that? Dad. Dad? <laughs> I could have missed it. It would have been good on me. Dad's gonna be wishing it was mom. Because he really wants mom to fall off. Are you okay? You got this. Hold on with your legs. Good job, give her a big pat. 
Good job, kiddo. Pull her up. Good job, Sophie. <laughs> You're okay. Sabrina and I are waiting for Gabby. Gabby and Storm, they're slow, aren't they? Gabby and Storm are the slow pokes of the group. So, how do you feel after your fall? Good. Did your leg still hurt? Um, no. No. Do you think just a little bit. you think you'll be nervous to ride again, or you think you're just gonna jump back on and go for it? Jump back on, just Sabrina's tail sticking out. Jump back on and go for it. Yes. Yeah, that's my girl. Everybody, can you feel the groove? And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.